talked about the you know getting to the main stage um to be in first place though at this point in the season with everything the team's been through with injuries and a number of different things what, what does that say about this group in your mind uh i think it says a, a lot of different things um you know, I, I don't know if I can necessarily pinpoint, <laughs> uh, you know, everything in terms of what we've been through, but I, I think we've been able to learn uh, throughout this process what it takes to build something special or something different or unique. Um, and then how much, uh, I want to say sacrifice it takes uh, to show up every day, do your job at a very high level. Um, and then depend on the, the person next to you to do their job at a high level. Um, and it's not just a concept. It's more or less about the actions that we put forth and the energy that we put forth. So I think we've been able to learn how to be flexible with one another, um, how to expect um, things from one another uh, without expecting too much, uh, just holding each other accountable. And when you do that with a mature group, you're able to accomplish a lot of different things. So I feel like we've been able to really just – just take this time to develop deeper relationships, sort of say. We're all new, and this group is so new. So it's just we had big uh, transitions in the season that we just had to adjust to, and I think we're doing a good job just figuring it out. So This next question is in that same vein, but within the game itself, Houston came to fight tonight, obviously. What do these grinded-out kind of victories reveal about you guys? Uh, I, th I think it it, re it reveals very little, honestly, you know, uh, because we're going to get every team's best shot. We, so that's something that we've come to accept. Um, and when I say it reveals very little, it's just that we know the game plan <laughs> that we need to execute, and it's up to us uh, to go out and do it at a very high level. Um, you know, sometimes we'll make that choice in the first four minutes or the first five minutes where we get down 18 to 6 or 18 to 4, and we're just digging ourselves out of holes, um, you know, in the scoreboard. So... You know, I'm listening to the chatter from other teams on the court, um, and they just continue to say, attack us, attack us, attack us. And I'm here you know, on the court as well with, with all my teammates just saying, you know, it, it'll turn over for us. We, we just got to be resilient, persevere through this, um, and, and you know, we'll start making shots. But more or less, it just comes with our effort, man. Got to bring it from the first five minutes. Um, in the last few games, we have we failed to do so. So we've played catch up, and we got away with this one. But against the great teams, we know we got to bring it from um, minute one. Brian Lewis with the New York Post. Hey, Ty. Uh, twofold. I mean, what I guess helped you guys turn that effort level in this game? I mean, obviously they had you on your back foot. What helped you guys turn that effort level? And just when you consider how long. KD has missed with a hamstring. I mean, how concerning is it when you see James go down? Uh, anytime someone goes down, it's very concerning. Um, anytime someone doesn't play, we, you know, we definitely have to uh, have that mentality that, uh, you know, we're still going to play at a very high level. Uh, so just got to adjust, man. <laughs> it's not going to get any easier. So when we're out there, we obviously know the guys that are missing, um, you know, guys that, uh, you know, I mean, we say guys, but KD uh, specifically, um, him missing significant time, we miss him. You know, we can't wait for him to get back, literally. <laughs> you know, but we're all staying patient. Um, we know what he brings to the table. We know the respect that he garners from all of us in, in terms of a leader on our team. Uh, but we, we got to figure it out game to game until he's back. Um, you know, if James is out further time, which I pray he's not, uh, then we just got to figure it out. It's just almost like the first question um, that I was asked is just we've be, we've learned how to become flexible I think a lot of people can speak to that sentiment throughout this NBA season specifically is that just got to be flexible throw the guys out there um, that are ready to play and, and we just go out there and compete so just figuring it out